Hello, travel junkies. Greetings from Chiang Mai. I'm in Thailand for the first time, in northern Thailand, and we're going to be visiting a beautiful temple. It's the mountain temple, Doi Su Tat. Here we go. So here's what you see when you walk in, and that big, beautiful, gold thing over there, that's inside is where the Buddha relics are that the white elephant carried up 16th century. This right here is a white elephant, and albino elephants are lucky for the king. They symbolize energy and power. And these are the two guardians. What mess with these guys? Guardians of the temple. These are the steps that will go down. Here's the king and the queen. And they're wearing the colors according to the day of the week they were born. So he's born on a Monday yellow, Friday blue. I was born on a Tuesday. I'm going to figure it out. So you can sign and leave a message here. And then it's going to go on the roof of the temple over there. So Rob is going to write something lucky for us. My handwriting's terrible, so maybe I'll initial. Here's where you write your name and the people you think about, and then on the next full moon, the monks will pray for you. Here are the Buddhas of the week, so that's Sunday, then two for Monday. Tuesday, this is me, my day, reclining Buddha. Wednesday is the middle of the week, so you have two. Then Thursday, Friday is a special one. Why? What's what's Friday doing? Look at all the dragon heads at the top. Dragon is Saturday. Wow. A dragon Saturday. Wednesday, Wednesday evening. And don't forget to head up the stairs for the stunning panoramic view. It's a little cloudy. <laughs> We're above the clouds, but wow. Take a look at Shing Mai. So I'm going to sit with my fortune in it. Okay, so So I can keep this one. Yes? I got a good one. <laughs> so now I put this back? Yeah. Okay. Alright, it says the second number tells you that you will have success in what you're thinking. Luck and love will be yours soon, but you should be patient. It's a good one. Now I have taken off my shoes. And we're going in the temple to see the remnants of Buddha. Here you can make an offering to the Buddha relic. Yeah, it's beautiful. Here's where you pray to the monks. You can leave them flowers and like candles and they built the steps. So, you put the gold leaf for different things you wish, so since my job is talking, I'm doing good talking. Put the gold leaf right on there. A little bit on the nose, too. 
It's really beautiful up here because there are all these different rituals and we're getting to learn them and do them and it's just so different but so peaceful. I went right there in the valley and then we have a good family. blessed by the monk and we weren't ready for it but they get you with water and we thought it was just gonna be a drop but it was like a squirt gun so they got me right in the eye but then he took a photo this whole thing is amazing especially just if you're not as familiar about Buddhism and you get to do all these things the number three is a big thing if you do something you do it three times but it's just stunning up here so try to do as many of the things as you can and then for Rob for men it goes on the right wrist I hope you enjoyed this video. Another tip, when you pray, it's not flat like this. It's like a lotus flower, so you put a little bit of space. So I hope you enjoyed this video. The information about where I am is in the description. Comment, like, thumbs up. I'll see you next time. Bye.